Hello, Simon from simonwoods.com. Uh, today I have an English sparkler, um, a Britannia they put on this one. Uh, it's uh, uh, Britannia's the, 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 the term coined by, I think it was Christian Seeley, um, and uh, this is his um, ex-wife, uh, Corinne Seeley, who makes this wine at Exton Park. So it's Exton Park uh, Rosé. Uh, is it non-vintage? I can't see a vintage on it. Pinot Noir, Pinot Meunier, um, Chardonnay. Uh, let's give it a whirl. Juicy, crisp, the slight edge of smoky bacon. Uh, I've been using smoky bacon a lot in my tasting notes today. I've been I've used it for a Chilean Pinot Noir and I've used it for a Douro Red. But here there is a, a definite hint of smoky bacon. Uh, there's some uh, light raspberry and strawberry character. There's apple. Uh, it smells like it's going to be quite bracing and fresh, but uh, let's see what it tastes like. Yes, definite hint of smokiness there, um, and uh, there is these, there is these red fruit flavours, uh, a little bit of uh, cooked apple in there, and this citrus citrus freshness. Finish I'm left with um, has um, it's strange that there's a classy bit and there's a welcome rusticity, um, and um, I, it's, I I've I've had better English sparklers. Um, uh, my, maybe my problem with it is that uh, the finish has, it's just a little on that tart side and it hasn't got enough flesh uh, to back up that um, uh, that crisp acidity. Um, maybe a little more, more dosage would have rounded it out. Uh, um, and then there's this smokiness. Um, so good, but uh, but not great. But, hey, I think this is the first time they've, they've, they've released a rosé, but uh, very good for a, first, first, uh, for a debut rosé. So, thumbs up. See you soon.